Hello, it's Denise Mortimer in the house, and I'm going to share with you a five-minute video about accessing the frequency of wealth so that you can get into the frequency of wealth. You can feel what it feels like with every cell of your body. This is for coaches, healers, speakers, therapists, and consultants who want to know how to get and stay in the frequency of wealth. So if that's you, you are so welcome here. So many coaches, healers, speakers, therapists, consultants talk about wanting to create wealth, but they hold some limiting beliefs that keep them in a place of scarcity. Scarcity, worrying about money, thinking that no more money's coming in, that they can't spend what they have. Maybe you recognize yourself somewhere along the way in there, because that was me. What I'm about to share with you is the key to connecting with your own wealth consciousness. Wealth consciousness is not exclusive for people who already have money. Everyone has access to wealth consciousness. It comes down to a simple solution. And that is when you call in the frequency of wealth. Now, you may or may not understand that we are all just energetic beings and our emotions and our feelings have a vibrational frequency and the higher frequencies are positive and they call in positive things and the lower frequencies, you know, guilt, shame, despair, call in, call, we basically we attract the frequency that we put out. And often people have a frequency that is subconscious that they're putting out and it may be one of lack, it may be one that they've gathered from childhood and they don't even realize that that's why they're not getting what they want. Um, so consciously they're saying, oh, I'd really like to create a successful business. And then the evidence is showing contrary to that. And it may be because it's very often because they're, they're vibrating at a frequency around money that is left over from childhood. So it's really important to clear that. And we're gonna do that in just a minute. And first I wanna make a disclaimer that this process is not for you if you're not willing to give up the old paradigm and new, learn a new way to be around money, a way that is much easier and much more flowing. So this really is for someone who's ready to consider a completely different way of being. This is not getting you into doing more, um, pushing harder, getting more products out there, working long hours. This is completely contrary to that. So you ready? Let's go. Okay, make yourself comfortable. Find a place where you can sit for just a few minutes and you can just make this time for yourself. And as you get yourself comfortable, you may wanna put your hands on your lap with your palms facing up. Having those open palms is showing the universe that you're ready to receive and often we can all do a little bit better at being open to receive. So keep those palms open. Take a nice deep breath in and exhale. And again, take a nice deep breath in and exhale. And just one more nice deep cleansing breath in and you exhale. If you haven't already closed your eyes, you may want to close your eyes now and just let all your worries just drift away. Just imagine them melting away. Just allow yourself to rest, rest, sink, drop down as comfortable as you could possibly be. In fact, maybe you've never felt more comfortable in your entire life. And any thoughts that come into your head, they come in and they just pass through. You're not entertaining any thoughts at the moment this is just purely time for you to connect with that frequency of wealth that tremendous sense of well-being and right now i want you to imagine if you've had some limiting thoughts around your relationship with money if you've not created the amount that you've wanted if you've shied away from asking for what you want if you've overgiven and undercharged, if you've been afraid that money's never coming back to you again, you've been afraid to spend it. 
whatever it is, allow that, allow that to come to the forefront of your mind and any negative, any negative beliefs, any negative feelings that you've had around money, just bring them all, let them collect in the forefront of your mind. And then I want you to imagine, imagine from the top of your head, from your crown chakra that you've got this beautiful golden light coming down from the heavens, from up above and just opening up your crown chakra and illuminating your entire body with this beautiful white healing light. And as your crown chakra opens up, you find that all of these negative emotions, beliefs, experiences around money, they start seeping out, going up, coming out through the top of your head. And you can see them each floating away like little bubbles coming out of your head, coming out of your system and all heading up, up and away. And you can see them shifting, moving, going up into the universe and energy can never be lost or, or destroyed. It can only be transmuted and all of those old experiences because they've gone into that light that's been coming in through your head, they've headed up towards that light. These are transmuted into something positive and beautiful and cleansing. And as you let the last bits of any old negative beliefs around money leave your body, that beautiful golden white light that's coming in and cleansing every cell, you can feel yourself, you can feel yourself upgrading to becoming a wealthy person. You can feel this with every cell in your body. And right now in your mind's eye, you can see the image of yourself as a wealthy person. You see numbers in your bank account, but more than that, you can feel what it feels like, that feeling of abundance. Where do you feel it? So you take a nice deep breath in. Notice where you feel the feeling of wealth in your body and imagine, imagine that just one cell in your body right now is the complete embodiment of all the wealth you've ever imagined. You can see yourself in the clothes inside this one cell. You see the clothes, you see the, the cars, the lifestyle, whatever it is that enables you to feel wealthy just existing in this one cell and amplify the feelings in that cell. Imagine that you are looking at that cell under a microscope and you can see everything happening, your wealthy self inside that cell. And then as you move away from that cell, that cell then has a knock-on effect with every other cell in your body, like a domino effect. And every other cell in your body now becomes infused with the frequency of wealth. You can feel it trickling. Every single cell of your body is alive, is ignited, is fueled with the frequency of wealth. You've let go of all the negative. And now there's only the high vibration frequency of wealth existing in your body. You can feel it tingling. You can feel it in your face. You can feel it across your eyebrows. You can feel it running down your hands, the tips of your fingers. You can feel the wealth as you call in all this prosperity. And you know that you don't need to know how it's coming to you. You just trust it's on the way. That you will be divinely guided because there is a divine intelligence that guides us all and you trust this intelligence and you allow this feeling to amplify more and more and more this tremendous feeling of wealth all over your body. And know that you can come back to this feeling anytime that you feel that you need a new increased dose. You need to be infused with the frequency of wealth. Again, you can come back. And so right now you take a nice deep breath in and you exhale when you open your eyes and you come back into the room. 
Welcome back. I hope that was a powerful experience for you and you are feeling alive with the frequency of wealth. You can drop me comments below how you're feeling after you've experienced this. And so what now? What can you do now? It's wonderful to do this exercise, but accessing the frequency of wealth is something that needs to be done on a consistent basis. It's about ingraining it into your psyche and making it a habit because all of those beliefs and all of those lower vibrational frequencies that you let go of, they were once just a thought and you thought that thought so many times that it became a habit. And so now you wanna make the frequency of wealth a habit. Failing to do that is like going to the gym once and thinking that suddenly you're a fitness expert. You know that it takes repetition. It takes time after time. It takes commitment. It takes a belief that you can be another way. Consistent action builds the muscle to allow you to access and stay in the frequency of wealth. And the consequence of not taking consistent action, well, you'll stay exactly as you are. You see, we cannot create a new habit until we're ready to take regular action and only when we're ready to take regular action. Sometimes we feel guilty, so we wanna take action because we feel guilty, but we know when we're truly ready to shift our reality into something new. And let's be honest, you already know the struggles that's got you to this point in your life. You know about self-doubt. You know your old stories about money. You know the frustrations. You know what it feels like to worry about money, worrying that it may never show up in your life again, worried about spending it, worried about where it's coming, gonna be coming from, just worried about so many elements of money. And maybe you're ready to know exactly how to access the frequency of wealth and how to live every day as a wealthy person and how to metabolize those negative emotions fast so that you can stay high vibe because it's not a case of doing this one time. It's a process and the more you do it, the faster you can work through negative emotions and get back to the high vibrational state. So let me ask you this, are you ready for a new future around wealth? If this is you, I want you to drop me an emoji below in the comment section of this video, and I will follow up with you and share more information about getting into that frequency of wealth. So you just drop me an emoji below and I will then reach out to you. And I just wanna say on the final note here, thank you so much for being here and I look forward to hearing from you.